I'm going to start recording myself doing one. So that way after this is over. Oh look, I found a utility right after the get go. So a bright blue orb is a data cache, right? Um. Yeah. Yeah. And White orb. Yeah, they might not be good to attack sometimes because there can also be bad things inside of them. So most of the time I ignore them. When I get a wrench and I'm low on health, I'll like instantly pop the wrench. Because you'll see it'll increase your health as you start clicking around. So if I get like a five or something, that'll usually tell me that I'm going the wrong direction. Mm -hmm. So I'll just like kind of do like a Ability turnaround. Systems you can use to two of those ones that look like badges. Field. Yeah, those. If you use one of those, it'll stop you from taking health damage. And once the yellow bar on your left side runs out, then the can will explode and you'll lose everything from it. So, if you get one failure, let me know, because I'll take over that can so you don't lose it. Do I want to attack any of these, or just... Yeah, some of them you're going to have to eventually break through. There's also things that pop up, and this is going to be a learning experience, so don't freak out. There's going to be things that pop up and they'll like make your virus weaker, or there's some called restoration nodes. They'll start restoring everything's health, like, drastically. So if a restoration node pops up, I usually always attack it. There's different things, like, you'll learn as you hold your mouse over them that do certain things. It'll give you, like, a mini description. Some of them will make your virus weaker so you can't attack as efficiently. Some will ruin your defense so you'll lose, like, health and stuff. 